India has been competing with numerous other countries in the development of a fifth-generation fighter jet. It is ready to launch with the first fifth-generation fighter plane produced in India and is awaiting the financing to be released. According to Outlook, the Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft, AMCA, India's first prototype fifth-generation fighter jet, would undergo a critical design review procedure in December. The AMCA aircraft's wind tunnel model was recently displayed. According to representatives of the Aeronautical Development Agency, a part of India's Defence Research and Development Organisation, the plan then needs approval from the Cabinet Committee on Security. It will soon approve the AMCA, according to media reports. Once the project approval is secured, the first prototype may be put out in three years, and the maiden flight can be in one to one and a half years after that, in Defence Expo 2022 where a model of the AMCA was shown last week. This timeline indicates that the AMCA will take to the skies for the first time in 2028. Along with choices about the defense budget, the CCS, which reports to the Cabinet Secretariat, is in charge of making significant appointments and decisions regarding matters of national security. The CDR attempts to finish the analysis, simulations, drawings, and testing in order to finalize designs. Most of the indigenous products for the Tejas Mark II are also being developed by HAL and DRDO, such as the pilot ejection C-10 the mid-air refueling knob, which will aid the AMCA project greatly if they are successful. The Tejas Mark II is slated to fly for the first time early next year, likely concurrently with its involvement in the AMCA, which will be India's most eagerly anticipated project. Many other nations, including the USA, the UK, and Japan, have expressed a desire to participate in the development. Additionally, engine manufacturers Safran, GE, and Rolls-Royce are also interested in collaborating on AMCA projects. The AMCA would be a stealth fighter jet weighing 25 tons that had twin engines and an internal weapons bay. A driverless supersonic intake, which was created for the first time in India, will also be included. It is useful to compress the air that prevents Mach speed breach, while directing boundary layer airflow away from the aircraft's engine, doing so without the need for a splitter plate. The aircraft's radar cross-section can be reduced by the internal weapons bay, which has a payload capacity of 1,500 kg, an exterior payload of 5,500 kg, and an internal fuel capacity of 6,500 kg. This will increase the stealth of the aircraft. Comment below with your thoughts on the AMCA development. Please like and subscribe to our channel if you are a new viewer.